Hi, my name is Janice Townsend, and I'm a local realtor, and I also serve on the Ypsilanti Community Schools Board of Education. I am actually from Ypsilanti, and I attended this school right here, Erickson Elementary, and also Artist Elementary School. I later went on to West Middle School, and I graduated from Ypsilanti High School in 1992. I started my college career off at Michigan State University, go green, go white, and but then I later finished at Davenport University out of Lansing, Michigan. I'm married I have to my husband for 22 years. He is also a teacher with Washtenaw Intermediate School District. I have two adult daughters, Jasmine, who is 25, and Kiera, who is 20, who also graduated from Ypsilanti Community Schools. I love this city. I'm from the South Side, and then I also grew up right down the street from the high school on North Lawn Street. I work, as I told you before, at selling houses, but I also worked in the banking industry, and I loved it for over 20 years. I love selling homes, and the reason why I sell homes is because I wanna make sure that people have great places to live and that they can grow their family right here in Ypsilanti. I also sit on other boards and I'm also a member of Zeta Phi Beta Sorority Incorporated, which is a historically black sorority which was founded on January 16, 1920 at Howard University in Washington, D.C. In my spare time, I like to hang out with my family and my friends. I sing. I used to play basketball, not anymore since a bum me, but I love sports. And of course, I love to do different things like crafts and simply just design and do graphic designs for the different organizations and groups that I work for. There's always time to read. Reading is so fundamental. It's a time where you can sit back, dream, envision about your goals, and just to get to learn about the different things. And what I like most importantly about reading is I get to learn about who I am as an individual, my race, my culture, and what it is that my people did to contribute to this great world. So at this time, I'm gonna get ready to read a couple of books for you, and I hope that you will enjoy them. Today, I'm gonna read Who Are Your Peoples? by Bakari Sellers, which is a New York Times bestseller author of My Vanishing Country, and it's illustrated by Reggie Brown. When you meet someone for the first time, they might ask, who are your people? And where are you from? You should always be proud of who you are. Your people were strong and smart. They dream of things not seen and imagine that we could all be free. Your people were fighters. When they were told they had to leave because of the color of their skin, they sat down. Your people were mighty activists, champions that struggle for justice and equality. They marched so that people would know your life matters. And they stood up and ran to make history and changed lives. That looks like our last president, President Obama. Your people were trailblazers who changed laws and broke records. Today, we stand on their shoulders. When they ask you, where are you from? You are from a land where the soil is dark and matches the richness of your skin, where cotton and sugar cane were strongly rooted and marked, matched your strength and determination. You are from the country where times move with ease and where kindness is cherished. We say a simple hello to our neighbors to let them know we see them.
you are from a place where the aromas of cakes and pies wrath from the window seals to fill your bellies with goodness and your hearts with love. Wow, that's a lot of food. You are a product of the proverb, it takes a village to raise a child. Look at all of these people. How many people are in your family? I have a huge family. You are from a place filled with love and hope and expectation where people rooted for you to succeed. Today, we stand on their shoulders. On their shoulders, you are so strong and so loved. On their shoulders, you can reach for the sky. So what will you dream and how will you change the world? The end.